Hello, my name is Cormac Strelan. I am a professor of computer science and head of the UCC School of Computer Science and Informa Information Technology. You're very welcome. Um, I'm just going to give you a brief overview of the different postgraduate opportunities that exist in our school in UCC. Firstly, just to give you a little bit of background information on the school. So we have just under a thousand students, a mixture of undergraduates and postgraduates, um, over 30 academic staff. And I suppose we'd like to um, say that we have a heritage in computer science um, in the sense that George Boole was the first professor of mathematics in UCC. Um, and of course, um, his work subsequently led to the development of Boolean algebra, which underpins all modern computing uh, technology. So we have um, a long history you might say, in um, the area of computing. Today, in terms of postgraduate opportunities, um, these are divided into taught postgraduate opportunities, which are one year programs and research. I'll talk to you first about the, the taught opportunities. We have four programs, as you will see in the slides. Uh, three of these are MSc degrees, one year programs, um, and the other is a higher diploma in applied computing technology, which takes um, nine months. Um, the MSc in Computing Science, there's about 30 places. Um, it is an requirement of uh, a second class honours grade one or equivalent. Um, this is also similar for the MSc in Data Science Analytics. Um, the Data Science Analytics programme is uh, jointly offered by our, uh, our partners in the uh, UCC Department of Statistics, the School of Mathematical Sciences. Our MSc in Interactive Media has 40 places and the entry requirement is a second class honours grade two or equivalent. And then our higher diploma in applied computing technology has 40 places. Um, and I should say the diploma and the MSc in Interactive Media are conversion programmes. So they're specifically designed for people who don't have a, a computer science background, um, whereas the other programmes are designed for students that do have um, some amount of computer science um, in, their, uh, in their undergraduate programmes. We also have activities in terms of research and our school is incredibly um, research active and um, you'll have seen earlier that we're ranked um, in the top uh, two uh, or in the range 201 to 250 um, in the world in terms of the QS rankings and a lot of that comes down um, to the student experience but also in terms of our research activities which today are spread across four major areas um, so we have a significant activity in artificial intelligence and algorithmics um, in software engineering and um, software systems, um, networking, um, uh, interactive media um, and human computer interaction. And then finally, in cybersecurity, privacy and ethics. So in these four areas, uh, we have very significant research activity. And if you come to our school, um, the people who will be lecturing you and teaching you and supervising your projects are people who have expertise in these in these particular areas. Now, in terms of research opportunities then for, for postgraduates, as, a, as distinct from taught programmes, um, we have a number of research centres that we're involved in. These are external national research centres. Uh, some of these you may have heard of, like Insight, which is the Centre for Data Analytics, and um, Connect, the Centre for Future Networks, uh, Lero, the Centre for Software Engineering. Um, and all of these centres, including our centres for research training in AI and in advanced um, networks for sustainable societies, um, are currently recruiting or will soon be recruiting for a fully funded PhD studentship. So if your interest is in a research degree, a PhD, um, or indeed a research master's in many cases, um, you should approach these, um, uh, these particular um, groupings. I did mention our master's degrees um, and our diploma, and I just want to briefly explain the difference in terms of the technical content of those and, and really I'm not going to do this justice in the few minutes that we have so if you're interested you should follow up by looking at the details on the website but the MSc in computing science is a broad program and um, that gives you a background in advanced topics in computer science so it's intended for students who already have a significant um, undergraduate program in computer science or closely related discipline um, and then goes on to do a selection of, of advanced topics the data science analytics program is, um, as the name implies, it's looking at the, um, the emerging area and, and very much in demand area in industry of data analytics. And, and this includes courses from our colleagues in statistics on advanced topics, but also in computer science topics that are specifically focused on data analytics. So things like data mining, deep learning, um, and, and of course, advanced database techniques. Interactive media, as the name implies, is looking at multimedia. So things like audio, video and um, virtual reality, graphics and so on. Um, and then finally, the higher diploma in applied computing technology is intended 
as I mentioned previously, for students who don't already have a background in computer science. And really, it gives you a what you might call a very intensive course on the fundamental topics of, um, of computer science and um, preparing you for the workplace. All of our programs have great employability. Um, we have great links with industry, as was mentioned in one of the earlier slides, lots of partner companies, both for work placement and for joint programs. So um, we like to say um, and with confidence that our graduates come out and they're um, they're uh, industry ready. Right? So um, all of the students from these programs are, um, are are in great demand in industry. So I hope my short presentation has given you some insight into the different programs we have. There's some links on the screen um, to follow up. Um, and I do hope you um, uh, you enjoy looking at the different programs and the information we have online. And I hope to see you in our school in the um, in the near future. So thank you for your attention and um, bye bye.